Hello and welcome back to RimWorld and yeah we are going to let the game roll because uh, I am once again back to playing RimWorld. We, I watched the last episode uh, just to see where we left off um, but yeah I think we are doing quite well what we are waiting for at this moment is basically build this area here and i'm building the bedrooms now the bedrooms might take some time uh, since we are building it out of uh, marble and we only have pina as the constructor and builder of this colony we mm, might take some time to actually finish this but we are going to have to wait and see on that uh, hopefully we will finish in time now let's speed up a bit and let's see what we can do now Paulson is now quite well off. Um, he needs to eat. That's that's it basically. Pina, what is it that's making you slept in the cold? Oval bedroom, ate raw food, darkness. Yeah, okay. There's nothing major. It's a few things here and there uh what i should do i should probably do this like because it's getting we are getting to like minus degrees uh outdoors and um yeah that's not good we need to try to get as much stuff from this as possible what i'm going to do is put myself to plant cut which means uh, we will try to harvest as much as possible here so hopefully we will get as much of this harvest as possible the dog a bit uh, out of the fuels he had to eat some before he, he um, brought it into the freezer um, yeah uh, yeah what I'm why I'm doing this is because since this is outdoors and winter is approaching uh, you never know uh, when crops are going to die really they they do die a bit randomly when it's minus. Uh, when it's get when it gets too cold they will just die the the plants so trying to like harvest the things you have uh, when um, you have planted when uh, when winter is coming around is a good way of getting as much out of it as possible because yeah you never know when the the plants are just going to say okay i'm i'm done i'm dead i'm not going to work it like grow anymore um and they stop growing as well like non-ideal temperature t uh, temperature growth multiplier and so if it's too cold it will it will not grow if it's just cold but not too cold it will it will grow but much slower so getting trying to get as much out of this as possible is usually a good thing by just saying okay harvest all of it or as much as possible now we do need to get this stuff up and running Uh, Pina is doing quite 
well when it comes to building uh, she's building a lot now who is the one doing stone who is the crafter paulson but you're doing research yeah, okay you can finish the research which should be smithing yeah which is fine okay she has basically finished finish uh, finished this kill zone which is good um that's great now what i am going to do is actually do this just so there's no grass or uh, bushes in the way uh, just in case and let's see yeah we are going to put one over here as well and hopefully we will yeah i did put up a lot of uh, plant cutting stuff by heart like told him to harvest a bunch of stuff around the map which is necessary but maybe i should just cancel it all i'm not sure depending on how much left i'm not sure now leaving the berries is not necessarily bad because for example uh bears uh, can eat them which means we lower the risk of our colonists uh, colonists getting targeted which is good it's very good to not get killed by bears or any other kind of animals so yeah the, the new bed area is coming along it's not there yet but it, it it's getting there how cold is it it's not that it's not super cold it's just not warm it's like around zero and i have actually slept in that temperature before it's not comfortable even if you have a lot of clothes on clothes on and you have yeah it just it's not comfortable it's very hard to sleep um <clears throat> and smithing is done good uh we should make sure he prioritizes doing crafting at this point now there is a mod uh when it which gives you more control over the crafting but there's so many things that gets uh, put under craft uh working uh, like work order of craft there's so many things uh there that there is actually a mod which m makes it makes more options for for your priorities and which job they are going to prioritize uh, for example you might not want to make clothes before stone uh, stone bricks um, because you need to build you don't need more clothes because everyone has clothes but yeah but in the vanilla since it's listed for craft it doesn't matter going to do them in whatever order it wants to do them so and that that's something which i feel is a bit overlooked when it comes to the vanilla uh, that you don't have enough options just at least for craft there's so many different things in crafting which uh necessary to prioritize over other stuff which is also under crafting 
that um, I feel having the craft split up a bit more wouldn't be a bad thing for vanilla, but uh. it is released, so who knows if there's going to be any like changes at all. There might be, but you never know. Uh, these chunks would be nice to get rid of, but yeah, whatever. Let's leave them for now. Okay, this is a poor one, so we're going to delete that. Now, do Paulson have a passion for crafting? Yes, you do, which means your needs for recreation is actually going up. Yeah. Uh, inspired creativity. Oh, okay. So that means he will make something really good this time. Uh, or rather, I will make some something really good this time. Um, yeah, let's see what kind of wooden small sculpture we will make. Um, you can make legendary stuff and you basically need the inspiration uh, thing. Uh, inspired creativity, you need that to actually make legendary stuff. Uh, that's more or less the only way of doing it, but... It's... Um, it's so random, you can't rely on it. Let's see, what is it? Just a good one, which means it was actually a really bad one. Yeah. <laughs> well, whatever. Oh, Paulson is finally doing um, this, the stone cutting. Great, great, great. That's super good. Uh, now, he's not doing granite, be uh, or rather marble, because he needs to do granite first. Now, this can be turned off. Can we please turn you off? Yeah, uh, uh, and as the pop-up said, uh, I have only designated this to be turned off. It's not actually turned off yet. We need the colonists to get here to flick the switch. Which we will use you to do. Now it's turned off. And that is something to be very aware of, that if you don't want it to be used yet, you need to flick the switch. Uh, and if you don't have anyone on the uh, basic job here in the work order, you need you need to put someone on that to actually flick switches. But for now, uh, I think let's see what do we have for research which we could do we're not going to do it yet because we need um, long blades might be good great bows maybe though recurve bows are good enough machining microelectronics would be great Sterile materials would be good to get, but uh, yeah, putting uh, like sterile floor tiles in like my cooking area or, or other places would be really good. But we'll see what we can do. Pina is working as fast as she can and 
it seems like Paulson is making marble blocks as fast as possible as well, so that's fine. Now what we should do is order these to be chopped. Now we can't do it because they are not big enough, but we are going to designate them to be removed. Uh, we actually have someone just wander in and join. Alan! He is a torturer. He's a psychopath, trigger happy, staggeringly ugly. Uh, he's incapable of caring and social because he's a psychopath, uh, most likely. Uh, to no, basically, I think it's because of torturer. Yeah, most likely, but whatever. Uh, he is. He's going to basically be uh, be our researcher, our main researcher, basically. We could get rid of him, but I th feel like no. Let's not do that. Let's just keep him. He comes with a revolver, which is good. Uh, that means. Let's take a look at numbers for a second here. Now, me, TTG, uh, can't fight, so that's why shooting and melee is uh, just uh, marked with a, a dash. And uh, let's see. The best one for melee is Alan. I think it's Tatiana who has the melee, but Alan actually has some passion in shooting. So maybe that Paulson has 14 in that, but I think Paulson, like Paulson has so many other stuff he can do. Especially, he has crafting and medical. And I think he is going to be shifting away from researching and stuff and do some crafting and medical only. Now, his intellectual uh, skill is going to go down because he won't be doing any research or stuff that increases it. So it is going to drop, but um, that's fine. Uh, we should re make this and let's see, Tatiana uh, handling for Allen can actually be a three. Now cooking is not something I par actually want him to do. Um, let's see, construction four. Pina has a construction of eight. You can be uh, something like a serious backup if you have nothing else to do and you can haul and we'll do that one on a three so pause and do does basically everything else uh, before research Art. I have seven, he has a three. Now he has a burning passion, so he actually has quite good chance of getting really good at it. So let's bump his art one up and handle. No, I think Tatiana is going to keep on doing that. Um, at least for now. 
and hunting we can turn off and there we go and he can keep the gun I feel because Even though his melee is better, he actually has some shooting, which uh, Tatiana doesn't. And yeah. So let's keep this going. Now we have one more person actually doing some, some stuff. Uh, now we do need one more bed uh, so we should actually make one let's very quickly make one there we go and it's poor quality it's it's fine it's it's a good temporary one um let's see we uh, we are five people at the moment. He shouldn't be building. He should be... Could you please... Though it's... Well, what are you building? Your... Your four. I feel like that's not... I, I should actually turn it off. Um, I don't want him to build at all. Um, I feel like it's not good enough. Uh, he, I can turn it on when I need it, uh, when I actually need him to build. Uh, but at this point, I think Pina has actually become good enough that it's fine to just keep her doing. And we are not cutting enough stone quick enough, so it doesn't matter <clears throat> if we are like five people building, because we don't have enough marble to build all of it anyway, so. <clears throat> now he we might have him idle because there's not necessarily a lot of things to do but it's fine i'm going to designate these as harvest because yeah if we can squeeze out a bit more it's oh and we have a raid now they are preparing so we have some time and it is Two people with clubs. Oh. Kamazo would be really good to get. She has a construction. Yeah, Kamazo would be a good addition at this point. They would both be a good addition to the colony. We might... I hope we don't kill them, but oh, I'm not keeping my hopes up. Um, let's see. We need to approach them from over here somewhere. Where are you? Right, you're over there. You will most likely run up there and then straight over. Ish. We could, like, they do have clubs, so we could wait for them here or here. But they are going to have to, like, regardless, they are going to have to cross over. And that is going to be a painful experience for them, uh, because they are going to go very slowly. Um, so yeah and they are going to wander over here until they are ready to attack let's see how ready are we now paulson has the bolt action rifle pina has the normal revolver you has you have a poor I don't have anything else. I do have the short bow pour. 
or a short bow there. I'm not sure how accurate this one, like how much more accurate it is than the revolver. Let's take a look gear. Actually not, no, no the revolver is actually better so let's go with that. And the small sculptures that are there are good enough. So uh, what we need to do is put TTG on safe zone restriction. And it is... What I'm going to do is actually put... I'm going to expand the safe zone restriction to this so he can actually do like stuff in there so he's not completely uh, like bored um, and have having absolutely nothing to do um, or rather I in this case I um, and that is because in, I am incapable of violent uh, violence so and uh, traits are sanguine and kind so it's basically I I'm Buddha I can't fight I can't uh, I'm just a kind dude who can't hurt anyone and everything is just super good um, totally not true but uh, that is how it is over here at least so TTG in this case is absolutely useless in a fight so he's going to have to stay in the kitchen and the freezer now Alan Tatiana Pina and Paulson is going to be drafted at this point. Whatever you were doing, please forgive me for interrupting you and get over here. Now, whether where they are going to get, like where they are going to go, I have no idea. I should probably go over here. And let's, let's put up here. Let's set up this in a way which allows us to shoot as much as possible. And uh, they are not really in range, but they will be. I could move closer to actually um I mean what I sh probably should do is something like this. Let's get you over here and Uh, okay, that's not good. Uh, could you please, like, super quickly try to... Yeah, that's not going to... Oh, my. Okay, too bad. Um... We couldn't get anyone, that's... that sucks, but um, whatever. It is what it is. Now, do we have a grave? Uh, no, we do not have a grave. It is... Misk. Miscellaneous, that's very badly placed. There we go. And yeah, uh, there's absolutely no point in uh, 
taking off their clothes because they're they have the the tainted buff uh and that that can't be removed so there's absolutely no way of um, selling or using uh clothes from dead people uh without some hefty malices to uh, mood or sell uh, sell value or other uh, things now we need this to be up and running um, somewhat quickly now floors is a bit of a interesting topic because all floors have um, different like beauty value uh, wooden floor just makes it uh, zero paved tile is the same it's just nothing uh, concrete is beauty minus one so it's actually bad to have flagstone is just nothing tile sandstone tile is beauty of one depending on the on the um, uh, the material so if we check marble tile it's one but uh, some uh, materials actually make it more beautiful because of the uh, of the material uh, that is used for building something so if we take a look at this wooden walls give a beauty of nothing but a marble wall gives a beauty of one we we'll look at a granite i think it might yeah it's zero so it's nothing um and and a smooth wall i i think it's four i think it's a beauty of four and i think it also depends on what kind of material you smooth so marble is plus four but i think it might be that granite is less i don't i i, I don't remember i don't really care that much but we are going to have to end this here because we are three minutes over um so we are going to continue in the next episode sadly we didn't get gray or kumaza or whatever and uh yeah too bad they were too really good i'm gonna so yeah thanks for watching goodbye and i hope i'll see you in the next one